Well, now 632, breaking news again. A Columbus firefighter is recovering at a hospital right now. He was hurt while battling a fire in the short north area off High Street. But arson investigators stumbled onto something else not too far away. Tendebee's Tina Ramos is piecing together what played out here. Tino, good morning. Good morning. Let me put this in perspective for you, too, because it was just down the street one block where that firefighter was hurt. It was a trash fire in a garage that also involved a gas meter. But see, when this whole thing was over with, it ended right here with this pickup truck running into the side of this building. Let me tell you how this is all connected here. Now, I want to show you some video from that fire from earlier, about 2.30 this morning. Uh, that's when the fire broke out. Firefighters arrived on the scene. There was smoke just billowing from this garage here, just off of High and Russell. Now, by the time they put that out, an arson investigator was looking into the fire and heard some type of commotion just one block away. When he arrived at the scene here, that one block away, that's when he found that pickup truck. Apparently, the driver ran into the side of a restaurant here, was getting into a fight with another man, and then attempted to run away. Police say they did make an arrest of that driver. I want to bring you back here to the scene, too, because what we're waiting for is structural engineers from the city to see if, indeed, they can actually pull this vehicle from this building here. In the meantime, we're still trying to figure out who the man they arrested, why he was running, and why he crashed his vehicle here. We're going to keep you updated on 10TV and 10 10TV.com. In the short north, Tino Ramos, 10TV News.